What's up guys? I am excited to get you this boat tour because as of today, which is July 7th, 2021, this 50 foot sailing yacht is still available for $1. Anyone can buy it for $1 and it's in surprisingly decent shape for what it is. But real quick, before we get to the tour, just wanted to remind you guys to hit that subscribe button. That helps us a lot. And I wanted to apologize, Randy is not with me for this one. She wasn't with me when I filmed the video because she was taking care of the baby and she's currently taking care of the baby now. So just want to get this video out to you guys. So I'm filming the intro and outro myself. But without further ado, let's get to the the tour. You know, from right here, it don't look too bad. It really doesn't. Not even from the inside. Alrighty guys, for sale for one dollar, this 50 foot, 11 and a half foot wide wooden yawl. Let's take a look at what this boat looks like. This is the aft deck. Looking forward. Definitely a pretty boat. Also, if this is a yawl, it looks like it's missing the mizzen mast. Taking a look inside this aft compartment below the deck. Got some storage. Honestly, you know, the bright work could definitely use work, but doesn't look too bad it's seems all salvageable you got some boxes for durade vents all along the coach roof this is a pilot house design and yeah i mean these decks don't seem that bad off for a one dollar boat i would have expected worse This is the mast. Double spreader main mast. Got the boom, there is a bit of a crack right there. Going forward. Got a big forward hatch. On the foredeck, it looks like we have a boom for a self-tacking staysail. This boat is cutter rigged. We have a windlass as well as controls. Looking at the bowsprit and our forestay. It's going to be Hank on head sails. Looking aft. Definitely a classic looking boat and I just I love the deck salon slash pilot house. Going aft. Got our boom there. Yeah, looks like that boom could use some work or replacement. Looks like we have four winches here in the cockpit. Nice old school helm. All bronze. Behind the helm, we've got access to the steering. Storage on either side of the helm. That was the port side. This is the starboard side. You can see the construction of the boat down there. Looking forward. All right, let's go inside. Walking down into the main saloon in the pilot house area. We're going to look to our left to port forward and then starboard as you can see we've got 360 degree views and a place to sit 
This is the view from that little bench. This would be a nice place to sit in inclement weather, and you can still see forward. So that's awesome. Got our galley down here. Not a bad little galley. Modest. Got a sink and a stove. Looking into this compartment here. Looking into the floor. Our diesel is down below. It is a running Perkins diesel, I believe. Access could be better. Getting this out of the way. We've got a quarter berth to starboard. And forward of that quarter berth, we've got a forward-facing nav station. Looking forward to that. Our main saloon area and, I mean, I would not have guessed that this is a dollar boat. A lot of the wood in this boat is in pretty good shape. Surprisingly good shape. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, I mean, look at the gloss on that. Cedar-lined lockers. I mean, got some drawers. It's just really cool. This would be an awesome project for somebody. Here's the mast. Look at that wood. Very, very cool. table is just beautiful. Let's see what's underneath the settee. Looks like we got some tankage. Steel tanks. Looking forward. Going forward. We've got a forward cabin up here. It's kind of like a single berth, almost a double, but not really. Our forward head, our only head, not too bad, pretty good size head, and forward of that I do have to duck, it's pretty low in here, but we have the V-berth, forward of the V-berth we have the chain locker, and it goes pretty far forward. All right, guys, I'm in the bow of this dollar boat, and we're going to do the continuous below decks walkthrough from bow to stern now. All right, so we're starting up here in the V-berth, and I am ducked down, so I apologize for the choppy video. Kind of hard to navigate through here while I'm ducked. I am in the head now, going aft, and there is enough headroom for me to stand in the head, just not in that forward V berth. Looking into the forward cabin. Apologize for the lens flare, guys. Looking aft. Beautiful woodwork. All around. And let me remind you guys that this boat is a dollar. One dollar is the main set D. Looks like the boat comes with sails. Can't guarantee which ones or if they're in good shape, but it's got sails going aft. Got our forward facing nav station. Quarter berth, seat, and our galley down. Engine compartment below the floor there. And that's it, guys. That's the dollar boat.
Alright guys, so I want to know what you think about this vessel. I think it's a pretty good opportunity for someone that's a little crazy. It's definitely going to be a lot of work, but it was in surprisingly good shape for a $1 boat. Now this boat is owned by Kohler Craft in San Diego. It was there for a refit, but then it was abandoned and now Kohler Craft owns it. If you're interested in potentially purchasing this boat or you just want some more information, you can reach out to them. Their contact information is going to be in the description below. I'll be honest, if Randy and I didn't already have something going on behind the scenes for our new boat, I think we definitely would be tempted to take on this project because we're a little crazy, as you guys know. I just have one request, and certainly it's not necessary, but if you decide to take on this project, I would definitely like it if you'd reach out to me. Shoot an email to jordan at learningthelines.com because I would like to definitely follow along with that project. Or better yet, start a YouTube channel and document it. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick boat tour. I think it's a crazy opportunity and I was really excited to get this video out to you guys because I'm excited to see the response and to see if someone actually takes on the project and restores it. Full disclosure, I know nothing about wooden boats, so I have no idea the actual scope of work that this boat would take, so I'm not going to comment on that other than the fact that I think it would be a ton of work, <laughs> but that's just my uneducated opinion. Anyway, if you enjoyed this quick little boat tour, please leave a like, leave a comment down below, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell if you want to know each and every time we drop a video. Randy and the baby are definitely going to be in the next one, so you can look forward to that. See you guys. I've got it right and I got it wrong But I learned my lesson hanging on Come sit here with me by the fire and let it go.